Good morning everyone, I hope you're all strapped in for an exciting lesson today as we're going to talk about sticks. Okay, they're more than just sticks. They are the leaf and wooden ones that can be found in the living trees of Terraria. The, for the lack of a better description, tree ones are a subgroup of magical ones, part of the overall category of block placing ones, which are able to place blocks in the world associated with their own makeup. For instance, a living mahogany wand will place living rich mahogany wood blocks, as opposed to a living wood wand that will merely place simple living wood blocks. While the majority of the block placement tool classification is taken up by wooden leaf ones, there are an additional four tools that we can discuss in more detail at a later date, which are the bone wand, hive wand, dirt rod, and ice rod. The main commonality between the wood and leaf ones is that they can all be found within living trees. The only separating factor between them is that the living mahogany wand and the rich mahogany leaf wand are found in living mahogany trees located exclusively within the jungle, whereas the living wood wand and leaf wand are found in standard living trees that can appear anywhere within the pure overworld, as the ones are typically found within chests situated in apparently inhabited dwellings carved into the trees. It is speculated by some that the living trees are not grown but in fact built. This hypothesis is somewhat overturned however by the fact that the ones do not create wood or leaf blocks from magic alone but merely manipulate existing blocks held by an individual into a shape or form of their choosing. Other ideas consider that the living trees do actually grow naturally and that the ones are twigs from the tree that have been infused with its natural elemental power. Power. Further conjecture theorizes that the living trees are the original dwellings for Terraria's race of dryads before they were mostly wiped from the world. It is thought that the dryads may have originated in the jungle, growing magnificent mahogany trees, but when they expanded outside of the jungle, their power was weakened, so the trees were not quite as impressive as their jungle cousins. It is possible that the dryads stimulated the growth of these ones as tools to better help them manage their woodland domain, or again it could be a completely natural occurrence that the dryads made good use of. Whatever their origin, it's likely that they were put to good use in constructing villages and carving out dwellings within the living trees. While an interesting curiosity, the fact that the ones are only able to manipulate specific types of wood that are already held by a user, make them only slightly faster and more convenient for block placement than doing it by hand. In the grand scheme of things, and considering the much more powerful and useful items available in the world, the tree-like ones as a whole have been given an artifact rating of insignificant. That said, they could be argued to be a high level of insignificant, because face it, they're more interesting than a pebble, but compared to magic swords, they kind of suck. Anyway, feel free to argue about it in the lecture notes, just don't forget to subscribe for details on your next class, and feel free to donate to the course on Patreon, because I don't have the luxury of carving my own house from a living tree, and need to pay the rent. Remember to be here at the same time next week, and I hope you all have a great day.